you. Hello and welcome to another episode of MerklinTalk.se channel here on YouTube. Today we're going to talk about grass and how to make grass in the cheapest and best looking way possible. Grass grows almost everywhere along the railway lines, so it's something you gotta have on your layout. This is what it looks like when it grows along the railway lines. Like in uh, small bushes like this. Straws, straight straws, almost uh, brownish, a bit more green to the base. Your dealership offers grass pre-made from many manufacturers. I know Noch has like bushes of grass like this and uh, Woodland Scenic offers something that looks like human hair but uh, it's uh, colored uh, to green and uh, you cut it and, and plant it in small bushes or all over the way you want it. The pre-made products look fine and they're of good quality. The problem is the price. If you have a large layout and you need a lot of it, it will cost you a lot. For instance, the Noch product is like one euro per bush and you need thousands of them, so it doesn't really make sense. As you know, the concept with Märklin Topunktesse videos here on YouTube is to find the cheapest solution that gives you the best result. I will now show you how. So, considering to spend thousand euros on grass, Nah, I don't think so. Instead, I bought these at the local store. It's uh, 10 uh, paint brushes with a natural colored paintbrush. Then we need some uh, light green color. This is a uh, Burl Num Green from Polyscale. I know these are not available anymore, so you preferably choose something else. It shouldn't be too hard, it's not so uh, picky with the color. It's uh, it's more that it's a uh, kind of a light green like this one. And you uh, take some of this light green color and mix it into a water blend like this. Mixing the color somewhat with the water and then soaking the brush with uh, this diluted green paint and you can actually soak all of the brushes at the same time. One mistake to avoid is to have too much color in the mix because then the color will make all the straws to stick together when they dry and that makes the further the work further on harder I can promise you that. Lastly I just squeeze some of the excessive paint out of the brush before I let it uh, set it to dry. It reduces the risk of having the straws stick together. I put a spot of glue where I want to have my grass and then I just put the grass into the glue, dab it like this. You can spread the straw somewhat. Like this. There you go. I hope you found this tutorial on how to make model grass uh, useful. Uh, if you want to see more of uh, these videos, please subscribe to Merklin of Sweden YouTube channel here. And until next time, see you.